fabrication process. Um, I've got the master kit here. I just pulled the parts out and I uh, just want to show you how it hooks up. So we're going to start with the 90 degree elbow. This has three parts to it, a seal ring, the main body, and the connector. What you're going to want to do is put the fingers in towards the center like this. Make sure your hose is all the way out so it doesn't get jammed together. And then you're going to take your connector piece, put the fingers on the inside so they're going to fold down onto the hose. You're going to take the body, the 90 elbow, and you're going to put it on the inside of the hose, just like that, until you hear a nice click. We're going to take the straight piece and do the same thing on that side. Take the connector piece off, connect it until you hear the click again. Should be a nice sturdy connection for you. And then we're going to show you how to hook up the dryer to the wall. It's a quick, easy, painless process. You guys are going to love this. So I'm going to take the seal ring right here and I'm going to put it over the dryer vent. Just like so. And you're going to take your 90 elbow piece and you'll just push it over the top. Give it a good push. Make it nice and snug. Should be a, a nice connection for you. So next you're going to take your sill piece here to connect your straight piece onto the wall. It's going to stretch over the dryer vent. You're going to take your straight piece, push it on, make sure it's a nice tight seal. To shorten the hose, make everything more efficient, take some wire cutters and snap through that wire on this. and the, This will just peel off. You can shorten your hose up. Makes your dryer much more efficient you don't have a big mess behind your dryer as well. All right, so now we got it all connected. We're going to just push it against the wall and we should be ready to roll.